gentlemen, every day of freedom that we enjoy as Americans, we do so standing in the shadow of veterans. From our very first veterans who carved a nation out of their dreams to those who stand in harm's way at this very moment. Today, of course, we stand in the shadow of 1,117 young veterans who perished in literally the opening moments of World War II. Yesterday, December 7th, 1941, a date which will live in infamy. The United States of America was suddenly and deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. so proud as Commemorative Air Force to dedicate this piece that we call the Sacred Steel in honor of those who perished aboard the USS Arizona and for all veterans of World War II and the war since. It is these folks who have preserved our freedom and as the CAF we are very proud to be able to tell this story and now with the Sacred Steel to be able to tell it even better. This is the culmination of a long uh, list of planning efforts and so on by our museum director and her, uh, her uh, leadership team and so on to get a, a piece of the namesake of the battleship that carried our name in World War II. Uh, the idea was to talk to the U.S. Navy, make arrangements for getting a piece of the ship that went down in World War II uh, and started the uh, very beginnings of World War II as we know it. So we planned, we talked with folks. Bobby brought me the information and I said, Bobby, let's go for this. So over the last several months, he's been dealing with the U.S. Navy, going through all the protocol. We talked to local dignitaries and asked them for their arrival and their inputs, and they were here today. So today's a culmination of a long list of planning efforts put together just so we would have this memorial and this piece of ephemera in our uh, museum to honor those that came before us which is why we're here, to honor the veterans and those who came before us and allowed us to have this conversation today. You ask, what is our aim? I can answer in one word, victory. Victory at all costs. Victory in spite of all terror. Victory however long and hard the road may be. For without victory there is no survival. 